Hello, and welcome back to Tech It. I'm here in my house with my blue electric furnace and my crystal chest. <laughs> I love it. And uh, today, I'm going to start by building a battery box or um, a battery box for for my blue electric furnace because at the moment it won't work at night because it's run by solar power, obviously. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to take this pipe out and I'm going to put the battery box right there and reroute the power from the solar generators into the back of the battery box instead. So, um, how do we make one of them? Well, we need to get some batteries and they are made like this. So it's nickelite, tin and copper. Easy enough. So we'll get some tin out, some copper out, and some nickelite out. And we'll put it together in our project table. So we want to get four of them. There we go. And some tin, and some copper. Four batteries. Cool. And then battery box itself uses four of them, the wood, three iron and a blue alloy ingot. So we'll just take our blue alloy ingot out of here and we should probably make some more of them as well so let's um, let's build a bunch more of them. Is it iron? Yeah. So that was just combining with Nikolai wasn't it in the alloy furnace so we'll just uh, put them together and see what happens. Um, and then we'll get some iron out and we'll build our battery box. Got one wood there. Perfect. So it was here, I think. Um, like that. Oops. What am I doing? There we go. And then four batteries. And wood. Battery box. There we go. And this little guy, he... Um, he stores power, so he can store power from this, and at night the furnace will run off that power, um, which means that we won't need to have the this thing would charge up the battery during the day, and at night then the battery power can be used to power my machines. Um, I took that bit of wood and I used it in my bloody <laughs> battery box, so I need to find another piece of wood which is that colour. Uh, is it this one? I think it's this one. <laughs> Okie dokie. So now, if we look at the battery box, it should be gaining charge. Let's have a look. Here we go, yep, this, this line here is the charge it's gaining. And this furnace, was because it's next to it, will use the power. Now this thing is going to go straight into to here, which is not what we want, actually, is it? Um, so, what's going to happen if I macerate something? Do I have anything to macerate? Yeah. Now, ideally, we'll have this pipe um, taking it into the top of this furnace. But it might some reason it seems like it's connected to this, so maybe we'll put it in here, which is a bit odd. I guess we'll find out. Let's do two, just in case we're uh, lucky and it gets rooted up. Well, it seems like it's all just getting rooted up. Both of them did. Let's try another one. So, I wonder if it will still gain power when the furnace is in use. That's the real test, isn't it? To see how well our solar, solar panels are doing. Uh, see what happens with these two. If we're in luck, they'll both go up. Yes, so it, it's just connected by, to the box, but it's not actually accepting any input, which is good. These are uh, these aren't happy. These might need to go into the side of it. Oh, that's that's a bit annoying actually. Um, okay, let's let's change this around slightly. Let's just move the battery box to there. Does mean we don't 
Oh, actually, it should be fine. We'll take the floor out as well. That way we can take a wire from underneath if we need more power from the battery box. And uh, we'll put our furnace in front. And that looks horrible now, so let's clear that up a bit. Over there. It's getting charged perfect and um, we'll just take the wooden pipe we had before, put that back and like that and like it was before as well. There, there and the lever. There. So that should work now. I mean, it is a bit annoying that the battery box has to be in the wall. Uh, it's dark now, so it's hard to tell if it's working. Let's stop getting charged. Okay. I think it's fine. I think it's fine. And now we, we could build a electric version of this, but for now this is fine with the, uh, the coal source. Not really a problem. Just dump all this stuff back in there. and put the pipes back in the tools and we're going to get some lava now for our cobblestone generator that's what I'm going to build next, it's a cobblestone generator so we take some iron build some buckets, let's get, um, let's get two two blocks of lava for now, that should be fine and we also can pick up anything else we find on the way, but we need to find a cave we need to find a cave um, so let's head back towards Honeydew Inc because we know there's a cave around there. So that's over here. It's very dark and scary. So I'm quite hungry. Let's just have some pork for dinner. And we can sprint. Oh, there's rubber on these trees. Don't have a tap. Nuts. Oh well. Die! Zombie scum. Oh, there's two endermen there. I don't like it over here. I'm going to go back this way. <laughs> Too much water. We passed this swamp. Anything past here in caves? I haven't seen any. There's some rock over there, maybe that's a cave. Oh! Here's something. Aha! Uh, oh, damn. Die, stupid spiders. Let's um, get my torches out next to there. Cool. It's very dark. Okay, we've got some ores, which is nice. Let's take a couple of them. Hopefully we'll find some more nickel because I think we're going to run out of that fairly soon. It seems to be um, extremely heavily used in red power. I thought like four stacks would be enough, but it's actually... I need a lot more than that. But it's quite deep down, so we might not find it. But we are going to lava, so we might never know. Dark, dark, dark. Now I'm going to ignore, ignore the copper because I've got tons of copper and it's extremely common so I can't bother to get any of that. We might need to get some more coal. I'll just pick up a bit of coal because um, at the moment we're powering everything by coal <laughs> except the furnace. If we get some industrial craft power up and running we can start powering our other machines. So maybe some wind power or solar power would be good. That's the plan. Um, we need to find a way down to the depths. This looks promising. Hmm. Aha, lava. Oh, more lava. Oh god, too much lava. Oh dear. <laughs> So we've lost our um, 
Our tools. <laughs> We've got some more stuff. Let's uh, let's just build some basics. Oh god, that's a nightmare. Oh dear. Okay. Let's get a sword. A pickaxe. And an axe. Well, I don't need the spade really. Uh, oh, I do. I do. Let's build a spade. Screw the hoe. Let's use almost all my emeralds. Um, well, that's fine. That's fine. <laughs> use some more torches. Plenty of them. Oh dear, I'm gonna need some more buckets, of course, for the lava, which we just found. What a disaster. I should have looked where I was going. That's a rookie mistake. It truly is. Okay, let's go back. Oh, I haven't turned death points on, which is a nightmare. Ah, uh, there you go. Now, what that will do is when I die, it'll put a, um, automatic waypoint on my map so I can find where I died but I, I, because I died in lava it's um, not much point because all my stuff would have been destroyed by the lava but usually it is handy and also it would have been handy because I would have found the cave again and the lava which I actually need so yeah it would have been handy to have that on before but now it's on I'll be okay um, just gotta find that cave again I think it was over here, wasn't it? Run! Aha, here it is. That was easy enough to find. Now... Let's take some coal to replace what I lost. Oh god. I can't believe I fell in lava. <laughs> All my XP's gone as well. I only had level 3, but... Oh well, never mind. Never mind. This looks like the way I went. Um, was it down here? Yeah, it was. <laughs> God, I almost did it again. <laughs> Ooh. Oh dear. Oh, there's no source here. What I can find. There's one down here. Whoop. Source there either. Where's this coming from? Has someone already taken this. God. Let's find a, a pool. A better pool. Um. God, it goes down quite deep. Ah, no, that's the same one. I'm just going to ignore this ore unless I find something really poor, because I want to... Oh, there's some silver. I can't miss that. Can't send them to a bit of silver. If I find some more emeralds as well, we're going to pick them up, because we just uh, lost a lot of them. Um, lapis, that's handy. Ah, I saw some more lava there. So, um, I'm going to grab that. Skeleton. Oh, ow. Get off me. Oh, this is a treasure trove. Oh, treasure trove of monsters. Holy crap. Okay, let's do this. Hopefully the creeper will blow them up. Come on, blow up. Boom. Got ya. Oh, that was pro. Got some nicolite too. And some sapphires. That will replace my emeralds at least. And lots and lots of lava. Good, found it. Let's just uh, block off these water supplies. Because it's a horrible mess of water down here. And we can just mine all this stuff in relative safety. Ugh. I hate water. Where did you come from? Die! 
scumbag. Right. How do we get this lava safe? Hmm. Take some of this gravel. How deep it is. God, it's pretty deep. <gasps> oh my god, where did that come from? Oh Christ. <laughs> oh, okay, we're back, we're back. Um oh god, my stuff's still here. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh, good. Oh Phew. I was getting really worried. Oops. Let's just uh let's just do this. Let's just do this. God, where is this stuff coming from? I need to do a better job of lighting this place up, obviously. Spawning up here. Let's just light it up proper. Hope no more creepers come. Let's just collect all this expensive stuff, get the lava, and then get back home. And then we're sorted. Let's just build up here. Get some lava. Two buckets of this. Oof. We did it. We did it. Oh, I need to get those emeralds. Uh, sapphires. Good sapphires. Oh, God. Okay, there's some more redstone. Oh my god, look at this place. Oh, this is amazing. Ooh. Let's pick up this lapis. Oh, oh, diamond. Oh, yeah. oh, stay away. No, my diamond. What? Back again, back again, I'm on fire, it's okay. Ugh. This is, um, this has been a journey, to say the least. I think a couple of those diamonds got exploded, which is a shame. I'm, oh, I'm going to delete these death points. There's too many of them. Okay. This time we're not gonna bloody die. We're gonna we're gonna survive. <laughs> and we're gonna get out of here. But first I need to get that uranium because that's worth a lot. <gasps> Ooh, that was close. I think I'll survive. I will survive. Okay. This <laughs> I'm just I'm I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I'm gonna go back to the surface. I can't take this anymore. There's too much stress, so I'm just going to dig up, and I'll see you at the surface. Okay, I'm near the surface now. I think I'm under a river. Oh, I am <laughs> definitely under a river. I get all my torches to the bottom. I've built a tunnel up, and um, it'll be useful because I can take it down again when I want to go mining. Um, I think this way is probably safer, water-wise. Let's just hope we don't hit water. We did again. On the minimap, I'm not underwater. It's um it's confusing me. So this way maybe? <laughs> this this must be safe. It's a bloody Oh right, that's why there was nothing on the minimap, because this isn't the river. This is underground water. That's why I got confused. But we're okay, we're nearly at top, I think. I can hear the sheep. Which is nice. Yeah, you can hear them walking around. So I'll, I'll put a waypoint at this, um, this location. And that would mean we can find our way down to that awesome cave with all the stuff in. I just didn't want to stay down there any longer, I had enough. So we'll put a point here. Put a point here. 
um, mine, we'll call it. And that would mean we can come back to this point at any time and go down there and find the uh, all that stuff. Good. Right, Risk. we can go home now. I'll put one here, call it Research Lab or something. Lab. There we go. Okay. Good, we've got a lava, so... Next time, we can start building our cobblestone generators. So I'll just chuck all this stuff in here. I'll show you actually how much uranium is worth. We'll uh, watch this. Bam! Twenty-five diamonds just for three. I think there might be a bug because that doesn't seem right to me. That seems too much since it's actually you know it's quite common really. Um, but I guess if you want to use a nuclear reactor, you do um, need a lot of it. But yeah, it it's like it seems to me like they added an extra naught by accident because that's just way too much. Um, never mind. Okay. Right. So, we've got all our stuff. We've got ten sapphires to replace the emeralds we lost. Uh, oh, I need them. Yeah, okay, so, next time we'll build our generators. Until then, goodbye.